offensively for you guys tonight, you ended up taking 18 threes. What do you think they did successfully to keep you off the line? Uh, I mean, we'll have to look at the film. Um, you know, I think uh, staying connected to our shooters and, um, you know, Giannis and, uh, and Drew playing some one-on-one. -on -one and, you know, we got to, uh, you know, just look at it, see how we can get better, maybe get some more threes, um, you know, just score more efficiently. But, uh, you know, they played well. Credit to them defensively. They were good tonight. Um, now we got to come back and uh, do the same thing. Uh, Giannis and Drew playing one on one is typically something you like. That's a, an advantage situation for them. Um, how do you, when things aren't going right offensively, find different ways to create something if those one on one matchups aren't going well? Or maybe you just want to keep the one on one matchup. Uh, no, I mean, we need a little bit of both. You know, Giannis is a great player. Drew's a great player. Um, you know, those guys are going to make plays, um, have all the faith in the world in those two guys. Um, and, you know, they found some, they found some opportunities. It was, uh, and they just got to find more of them. Um, you know, collectively, we got to be better, and um, we will be. Mike, I, I realize you said you will have to look at the film on, on a lot of those threes, but in that second half, to try to come back from 26 down, you get to 13, but I think there was only maybe one made three. In that. Is, that just, is that just by math a harder way to try to do that against that kind of defense to just keep getting twos? for a quarter and a half and not even attempt really many threes. Yeah. I mean, you know, if it's uh, if you're down 25, anything's going to be hard and certainly, you know, mix in some threes would, would be helpful, but there were a few plays where, you know, it felt like we could almost get over the hump and um, you know, a couple loose ball block shot, um, you know, credit to them. They, they beat us, you know, pretty handily tonight, but there were, there were a couple plays in, you know, late third quarter and the fourth quarter, um, you know, felt like maybe we could have got it inside of 10 and just find a way, um, but, but we didn't. And, uh, you know, so we'll, we'll look at the film and see how we can be better uh, going into game four or three. Does anything just at, at first blush stand out as to, to maybe why it's been difficult for Giannis to, to finish around the rim? He's, he's gotten in there, and, and I realize some of it might be bounce to the ball, but it's uh, two games now where it's been tough for him to, to com complete a drive. Yeah, no, you got to give their, their defenders credit. Um, the guys on them, you know, um, you know, they're, they're solid, you know, good, good uh, defenders. And then, um, you know, uh, quite a bit of help. Um, and that's where, you know, we, he's just got to see it and feel it. And um, do we kick it and get more threes or, you know, he's got to finish um, against one-on-one, -on -one, um, you know, defense. So, you know, I think it's a little bit of both, um, but, you know, Giannis, uh, he always figures things out. And, um, you know, like I said, you know, we, we got to be better. Boston um, seemed to be making extra second, third, fourth passes. Does that make it tougher to defend their three? They were 20 of 43 for 46 percent. Yeah, certainly their ball movement was good tonight, um, you know, and so uh you know created some good looks and then you know Jalen Brown started the game on fire um you know he made some high high degree of difficulty shots got him out of the gate you know they were all confident um off that start from Jalen Brown so um you know we gotta we gotta defend you know Jalen Brown better we gotta define Tatum better got to define the three-point line better um so what the playoffs are about it's great you know game to game the challenge um you know to be better that by studying film and just closing out passing lanes or is some of this just unusual they you know 46 percent isn't typical well I mean they shot it you know really well um you know so we got to look at everything you know they they had some good clean looks um we got to reduce those and um you know hopefully uh the tough contested ones that uh that you know a couple of them knocked down um maybe they go the other way and the percentage is kind of regressed to the mean but I know their shooting percentage was elevated from game one, but were they doing something a little bit different with their transition defense? It seems like you were kind of neutralized there at times tonight too. Yeah, no, we're taking the ball in the net. With Brooke, I think he takes just two shots tonight. Um, as you're thinking through different things with the offense, is there a way to get him more involved? Yeah, you know, I think, uh, you know, it's something to consider. It's something that, uh, you know, we can look at and find just, you know, give him um, opportunities and um, even just, you know, touch it and things like that. So he does so much for us defensively. So um, it's something to consider. Yes. All right. Thanks.